Hey there, it's Trina Medvis from Fit for Females. Today, I'm addressing something really serious because this happens on a regular basis. This came into me today. Hey Trina, I'm reading online. I see all this stuff coming through my feed. Do bananas make you fat? I want to go crazy. So crazy that I'm sending this video right now after my sweaty workout because I just can't stand reading this stuff. And I, and I can't stand the fact that we are so inundated with so much information floating around on social media, on the website, when we're searching, and we're so desperate to lose weight, especially women, my clientele. They read these things, they're like, this is the next fix, and, and then I can't eat this, and I can't do all, you know, listen. Bananas aren't making you fat, okay? Bad choices make you fat. Stress makes you fat. Not moving makes you fat. Not using your body like it was designed. Staying up too late, being on social media, it makes you fat. Being stressed, anything can make you fat, but it's the excess things that we're doing. So bananas aren't the culprit here. Yes, if we eat too much sugar, too much natural sugar, too much processed sugar, yeah, you're gonna gain some weight, you know? How much are you eating? I'd be looking at what am I, what am I eating in my diet, but the bananas aren't the culprit. Those little guys, they're so good for you. You need the potassium. We need natural sugars. So it's not the banana that's making you fat, man. Don't go on a banana-hating diet, hashtag cabbage soup diet, hashtag I'm gonna cut my calories to like 1,300 a day and do all this crazy stuff that you don't need to do. Here's the secret. Take a look, keep your food journal, write it down. Like I'm talking pen and paper, not just in an app. You can do that if you want, you can get fancy. There's a million out there. Get a pen and paper, write down what you're eating. It's probably not the bananas that are making you fat. It's probably your negative thoughts about yourself. It's the fact that you're not moving. It's the fact that you're overeating. You're going through the drive-through. You're drinking, you know, frappadappa lattes and you're drink that's a fancy word by the way, frappadappa lattes. But you're doing all these other things that are not so good for you. You're eating from a box. The bananas are the innocent guys. Don't eat like 100 bananas a day, but they're great for a post uh, workout recovery snack. Like they're amazing. Throw them in a smoothie. So Listen, never mind your feeds, never mind all this stuff that's going around there. Say to yourself, does this make sense? Bananas come from the earth. Does this make sense? Should I eat one? Should I have one every day? Should I have one every other day? You ultimately, to, ultimately need to decide if it makes sense. Train with Trina, fit for females. Follow us below this link. I can't wait to share more videos with you. Don't worry about those bananas. In fact, go eat one now. Take care and have a good day.